you. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. It's great to be here. We've all heard the saying, find a job you love and never work a day in your life. But who chooses the perfect job? And when it comes to your career satisfaction, what are the most important factors to you? Is it having a great supervisor and a flexible work schedule? Or is it having a great salary with great benefits? Maybe it's all of those things. But no matter what's on your list, we all share a common goal. And that is to find a way to be happy in our careers. I want to share with you what has led to my success and ultimately loving and enjoying my career. See, I love my federal career. And it's because I've taken the time to understand the value of my service and how I can make a difference in any role that I acquire. Through my journey across many federal agencies, I've grown from an intern to a manager. And I've discovered three key things that I believe will also help you. Now, each of these has taught me how to value not only my career, but also myself. The first thing that I learned very early in my career is to be flexible. See, I challenged myself to not only focus on areas that brought out the best of my skills and doing things that I enjoy, but to also be open to many different kinds of tasks. See, I love to keep my resume fresh and to be able to show new experiences. Now, that doesn't mean that I enjoyed every task that I completed. But what it does mean is that if you don't allow yourself to be open to new duties and responsibilities that are outside of your norm, you may very well miss out on opportunities that can enhance and even further your career. The second thing that I learned is balance. And that is balance between work and everything outside of work. You see, your job cannot be the only part of your day. You have to invest in life around you and find activities and people that can motivate you. I love to volunteer for all kinds of causes, whether it's at my kids' school or whether it's for a campaign to support a cause that I truly care about. I look for ways to balance my day to day and to continue to add value to who I am. The third thing, and probably the most important thing I've learned, is to be strategic. Now that's not so simple, but what it means is to write down your career goals and to develop a career plan for yourself. And no matter what circumstances you may face along the way, remember to stay focused and to determine each step you need to take to reach your goals. Make every day count and every relationship work. And when something happens that you're not pleased with, just ask yourself, what can you do to make it better? Now, I keep a candy jar at my desk. And it's not because I'm in goody two shoes or because I'm trying to make friends. It's for one reason only. And that is because it makes others smile. And when someone comes to my desk or to me with a smile, I smile. If you can't find a reason to smile when you're at work, how can you truly enjoy being there? I don't need a perfect job. And I've never worried about what's on the other side of the job interview. The most important thing in my career is me and confidence and knowing what my value is. I leave you with this challenge. Be flexible. Create your balance. Be strategic. Make others smile and discover your value so that you too will be able to love your career and make a difference while doing so. Thank you.